Welcome to North American Shale Magazine's top headlines from the past week. I'm your host, Jill Nelson. Basic Energy Services is getting out of the pressure pumping business. The company announced plans this month to shift its focus to production and water logistics. Proceeds from the sale of its pumping units will be used in the next two years to fund work on the Agua Libre midstream pipeline. In the future, BASIC believes its water logistics segment will provide growth potential for the company. Find out when the pumping units will be shut down and how much BASIC will earn for the assets in our online breakdown. A new report from IHS Market shows the impact of base decline rate changes in the Permian. Oil and gas operators in the Permian Basin, the most prolific hydrocarbon resource basin in North America, will have to drill substantially more wells just to maintain current production levels, and even more to grow production, according to the report. But there is more to the story of base decline rates. Investor sediment, production strategies, and other factors will play a role in decline rates. Learn more in this week's newsletter. Harold Hamm, founder and longtime CEO of Continental Resources, is leaving his post as CEO. Hamm, often referred to as an oil visionary, will stay on as executive chairman of the board. Bill Berry, an executive from ConocoPhillips, will take on the CEO role. Jack Stark, current Continental president, will remain in his role and add chief operating officer to his title. As always, find out more on the latest news in the North American shale scene through our online newsletter. See you next time.